This video is brought to you by Osmocote, the planter's plant food. Today, we're going to be talking about what to do when leaf gall appears on your azaleas. So here is a blooming uh, azalea. This one is called Rosebud. It's a double flowering pink one. But when we have a lot of cool weather, the leaves sometimes don't open nicely like this. They get all cranky looking. Look at that. The gall of it is called leaf gall. And it is a fungus among us, and when the leaves kind of turn into, into little gall-like creatures like this. Now, it's easy to control. Um, all you do is follow this stem down and cut it off. Now, even though this is a healthy azalea branch with no leaf gall, I'm also going to cut that off. I'm going to cut this off, and I'm going to cut this off. Now, let me explain why. If you look at this whole big azalea shrub, naturally what happens with azaleas pruning after blooming. This azalea is almost done blooming, and so I go through and I remove the poodle dog tails. That means the little tails that stick out of the shrub, they're longer than everybody else. And by doing that, by grabbing it and going inside the shrub and removing that much, uh, you, know, you can use this as a cut flower if you want, um, but really what you're doing is you're tidying up the plant without having to shear the entire azalea back. So I'm just removing anything that's sticking out. Look here. See how this is sticking out far? Just grab it, reach down low, and prune it off. And it's a quick and easy way to do a little annual pruning and tidying up of your azaleas. So you'll have pillows of bloom rather than puppy dog tails sticking out all over. And this is going to help control leaf gall, that fungus formation on the leaves in the future. This has been Mary Ann Bonetti with Easy Answers for Great Gardens.